Choosing a market niche. Market discovery is all about selecting your niche, your keywords to target, and what products and services you will sell to your visitors. There are a few key factors that a niche market must have. Simply put, these can be broken down into the two categories of customers factors, product factors. One without the other will not work, so let's have a look at how you can find out whether your niche market will make the cut. Customer factors. Head down to the local news agent's bookstore, library, or your local Barnes and Noble to find a proof that there are money-hungry customers in your niche. Any niche that has lots of books about it is a great niche to go for. An alternative to the physical trip to the bookstore, etc., can be carried out by looking on a few sites. Amazon.com being a great one for books. Simply select books from the search dropdown and enter your niche. I'm going to select the dog training niche. As you can just make out, there are over 5,000 book results for dog training, meaning there is definitely enough interest in the niche. Searches that return over 2,000 results are good indications that there is a good active market for your chosen niche. You can also check out magsdirect.com as an internet-based alternative to making a trip out to the news agents. This site is easy to use and you can either search your niche or use the browse function on the left-hand side. This is also a very handy feature to help you select a niche if you are unsure of where to start. Now we know that a niche has a customer base and one that is likely to spend money. To find out that your niche has a good internet presence, you should find out who is blogging about the niche, how often they blog about it, and what parts in particular. To find out who is blogging about any particular niche, you can use these sites. My Blog Log Just enter a term related to your niche in the search box at the top right. In my example, I searched the term dog training, and here are the results. As you can see, there are nearly 300 matches found for members. These are the actual people who blog about dog training, and there are also over 7,000 communities. These are the sites that are registered on my blog log. To see what these people are blogging about, just click on either the members or the communities, and you will see a list of topics that they have recently posted about. From this, I can see that there is a pretty decent community of bloggers who are talking about my niche. Blog Catalog A site similar is Blog Catalog. Here, we are going to use the search feature located in the top right. Here are the results from the term dog training. Unfortunately, there is no total, so what I've done is scroll down to the bottom of the page, and you can see there are 206 pages of results. Plenty, so attain there is an online presence. The next step after you have made sure that the niche you have selected has a pretty good online presence in the blogosphere is to see what Google thinks. All you have to do here is head on over to google.com and type in the name of your niche. Here are the results for a search for dog training. Right, there are a few pieces of information that you want to look at here. These are how many results. In the bar under the search box is the number of results that have been returned for the phrase you entered. In this case, 14.6 million for dog training. The search results. The search results on the left show you the top 10 sites. Take a look at the top 10 to see what aspects they are talking about in your niche. These will be your competitors for free search engine traffic, so we will be using these results again later in the system. The sponsored ads. The sponsored ads appear down the right-hand side of the search results with a couple at the top of the natural results. You can use these results to see what kind of items or services they are selling. Now, from the search volume I have seen from both Google and the two blog sites put together, with the amount of books and magazines available, I can see that dog training is a great market to target. Product Factors we have found a niche that has a presence online and it also has a customer base. 
Now, we will look into selecting the right product a little bit later. So for the time being, we just need to make sure that there are products available that we can sell as an affiliate. We have already done the first part of this by using Amazon.com. Amazon offers an affiliate program known as Amazon Associates. You can sign up for the program here. The Amazon Associates program is ideal if you are running a blog, as you can refer any item sold by Amazon, and you take a cut up to 15%. That said, the typical rate is about 4%, so we want to find alternative programs that will provide us with a higher percentage of each sale. Pepper Jam Network offers a huge range of affiliate products and is great to find products to promote. eJunkie is a service that helps product creators to sell their products and services online. To carry out a search for affiliate products, services, change the drop-down that states Documentation as Standard to Affiliate Programs, then enter your niche and off we go. The results that you will see will all be products or services that you can promote as an affiliate and then earn a commission per sale. By clicking on one of the results, you are given a write-up of the product, the price of the product, and the percentage you will make per sale. ClickBank is a retail outlet for digital products and is a great place for affiliates due to its high affiliate commissions. To find out what products are available in your niche, click the Marketplace link at the top of the page and enter your search term. By entering the term Dog Training, there are over 399 pages worth of products I could choose to promote. In this example, there are products on the first page offering up to 75% of each sale. Google Search As you can see, some of the above offer a lot in my chosen niche and others only a few. This will change from niche to niche. Also remember that these are not the only sites. That said, they are, however, all I have needed to use. If you are getting stuck or want to explore further, simply enter the following string into Google. Dog Training Affiliate Program Here are the results. Over 500,000 results from the top 5 selection I have a variety of products I can promote or see alternatives to sites we have just looked at. If after checking all of the sites you are either not finding any products or just a handful, then your niche will not be the one that will sell well online. Ideally, you will be looking for niches with over 50 products or services you can promote. The reason that there are so many products in some niches is that they work.